Usually when I order things, oftentimes I have to order off eBay or Amazon and have them imported. But ever since I was made aware of New Type HQ, which this would sound like a commercial, which I'm not trying to do, because everything here I paid for myself, they pretty much have probably the best tool selection of any Gunpla store that I'm currently aware of in the US, without a shadow of a doubt, as I spent a lot of time hunting for things. And I remember talking to one of the owners of uh, New Type HQ, and I said, the only thing you guys are missing is Alkalad paint. And you know what they do? They go out and get Alkalad paint and start selling it. Like, Jesus Christ, talk about proactive. So I know where I'm buying from from now on. Hell, they even have paints that even other Gunpla stores don't carry. I don't have to order from eBay all the time anymore. But while I was hunting around for tools and whatnot, I came across the metal balls sold by Mr. Hobby. And I thought to myself, I think I need these. Because many of my paints are Alkalad. And if you work with Alkalad paints, sometimes it's a whole lot of shaking. You know, you gotta take the ball, you gotta shake it up. You gotta shake it like you're beating your dick. Oh my. And it's ridiculous how much effort I have to put into shaking sometimes. So I figured, why not buy these? These little steel balls, pop them in. It's the same thing you find inside of a can of like spray. Let's see how it goes. And frankly, fantastic. You might also wonder why I'm using these little nippers. Uh, what are they? Tweezers? I don't know the proper term, but whatever. They're the God hand ones. And I wanted to test how well they could pick up small objects. Fantastic. So much better than my Tamiya's. It's not even funny. I use these exclusively now. But anyway, I just wanted to put it out there for those of you who paint. Because I always felt that Alkalad should have the metal balls in it. But I guess since the bottle is made of glass, maybe they don't want to throw metal balls in there for some reason. Maybe it could be a hazard of sorts. Hell if I know, honest to God. But I know Spastics has metal balls. And it always made it so much easier to mix the paints before spraying. So for anyone out there who needs these, wants these, or thinks they're useful, hell, you could even put them inside Mr. Color bottles as well. I know some guys cheap out and get like nuts from the hardware store, like uh, Home Depot or Lowell's. I figured I'd go with these. They're smaller, easy to maintain. Obviously, you don't ever have to worry about them rusting inside the paint. You're golden. It's a fantastic product for anyone who uses an airbrush or anyone who simply wants to make mixing paints slightly easier. Though for some reason I still stick to the spoon method when it comes to Mr. Hoppy Paints. I don't know why, it's just weird. So on that note, I guess I should get the hell out of here. Because frankly I wanted to make this to be a quick video, give you a heads up that this product does exist if you've ever desired it. And New Type HQ carries it. Which is surprising, I didn't even know these existed until New Type, New Type HQ. Uh, what the hell's my promo code? It's a Gunpla, same as this channel, all in capital letters though. So, give it a shot. If not, you know, can't twist anybody's arm, which I'm not trying to do. I'm just saying I like this product and I figured I'd let people know. Well, back to painting. I'll update my base work later.